good early, early morning. It's me, Tom the Mormon, the compassionate, free-thinking, Christian anarchist, transhumanist vegan who has a love of all life and the blockchain. I'm here to bring you another early morning vlog in the dark. Uh, I'm just heading in to uh, figure out a way to fix the highway. So, I'll get back to you when it's a little uh, brighter. I'm just uh, heading out uh, early to work. And I was thinking about transhumanism today and longevity. Um, I was looking at longevity.io and uh, Life Extension Party today and looking at some of the technologies that they're beginning to reverse aging in it mammals, other species of mammals, um, uh, through various means that uh, basically extend the telomeres on the ends of their chromosomes. So, um, in, within 10 years, they should be able to do it with humans. The technology is there, it's possible, and it's basically going to happen. Uh, one of the main things to do is to change our way of organizing our finances instead of giving 99% of our wealth to 1% of the uber rich. Well, what we should do is go on the blockchain and distribute that wealth a little bit more evenly so that we don't have to waste gobs of money on killing machines military technology that basically isn't getting anybody anywhere. It's just everybody's got the stuff, but it's not really getting anybody anywhere. But that's a whole nother vlog in itself. The point is, is that just with a little bit of financial management, we could go on the, we could go on the blockchain and not have to worry about it. Once you're on the blockchain, you're cutting out the central banks, the uber rich, the 1%. Everybody's doing their transactions online, internationally. Why do we need all this excessive, I mean excessive, I mean you get pirates, you don't need a nuclear bomb to blow up the pirates. We could be a lot more efficient with our military technology without spending gobs of money on uranium technology and all that kind of jazz. There's so many easier ways to do things. There are so many easier ways to do things without spending gobs and gobs of money wastefully on uh, uh, basically military hardware. I don't mind military technology as much as I mind just inefficient military hardware that really doesn't do much. It's potentially able to destroy all kinds of things, but really in the long run, it's kind of a waste of money. And we could invest that money into studies that continue to reverse the aging process so that we can all live healthier lives. Now, people laugh, ha, 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 you can't fly. They said to the Wright brothers at Kitty Hawk, you can't fly, you bicycle-making crazy brothers. Go back to making your bicycles. Bicycles can't fly. But wait a minute. Oh yes, they can. The Wright brothers made bicycles fly. Is it really that far-fetched to think in this day and age that we can reverse the aging process? Well, they're doing it in animals now. They're having mice that live the equivalent of 300 years old.
Now, I wouldn't mind living to be 300 years old. You're reversing uh, all the painful diseases that are associated with aging. So you're not going to look or feel old. And wouldn't you rather have that than just spending gobs and gobs of money on military hardware? I mean, that's that's another vlog. You can figure out how you want to pay for it. But the technology is there. So let's work smarter, not work harder as much as work smarter and more efficiently and start doing things that make a little bit more sense. It doesn't take a genius to figure out that there's about 1% of the world's wealth taking care of most of the people in the world. And the other 99% of the wealth is owned by 1% of the people. Namely, corrupt governments and central banks, which by joining the blockchain, we cut out that, you want, I dare I say, middleman. If you had to travel somewhere from one country, some, from one side of the river to the other side of the river, it's because you have a job there. And somebody capitalizes on that and says, well, so you have a job on the other side of the river. I'm going to charge you 90% of your paycheck to get you across that river. And I know you'll take it because you still need that 10% to feed your family. You still need that 10%. But you have no other way to get across. So you have no choice but to spend the money and paying the ferryman to get you to the other side. And they say, don't pay the ferryman until they get you to the other side. Now the central banks are the ferryman, proverbial ferryman of this day paying our grandparents and our great grandparents' debts. It's all a bunch of little numbers on a piece of paper. It's all it's all imaginary. Hello? People are afraid to go on the internet and join the blockchain. Who goes, oh I don't know. It's, it's computerized. What do you think what do you think it all is? It's all concept. It's all pieces of paper they can print in a factory. Just a bunch of trees. Take a thousand dollar tree and turn it into billions of dollars of Paper currency. One tree worth of paper. So don't give me that. So don't give me that nonsense. If you still want to be a slave to corrupt governments and corrupt central banks that can just print money whenever they feel like it, Raise the prices of everything make us, to make us feel better. Oh, you got a bigger paycheck, but then everything else goes up. Look, it's a game they've been playing for way too long. It's going on a couple hundred years now. And the jig is up, okay? People, the jig is up. We don't have to keep paying this uber rich 1%. 99% of the world's wealth anymore. So join the blockchain. Subscribe and like my channel. Post your questions, comments, feelings, criticisms, and rude remarks in the comment bar below. I'd love to see it. If you think living longer and spending more, your money more efficiently instead of on transactions like arms sales that make the uber rich uber 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 rich and everybody else uber poor let me know and let me know how you feel about it and let's do something about it join together get on the blockchain let's be transparent let's be decentralized bank instead of central banks we want decentralized banking remember that decentralized banking think about it check out a blockchain TED talk okay 
get with the program. I'm Tom the Mormon. In the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Amen.